Hey everyone, welcome back. So for today's art activity, you are going to need a piece of paper. You're gonna need some paint, some scissors, and you're gonna need some tape or liquid glue, a black marker, and the weirdest thing that we're going to be using today, if you have one, is a plastic fork. Now, if you don't have a plastic fork, you can also just use a paintbrush as well. Just get creative. So, let's get started. Alright, so I have my paper ready. I chose the paint that I wanted to use for today. And I have my fork. Take your fork and you're going to dip it in the paint that you want to use. Just the tips, just like that. And you are going to just start decorating in a circle. We are making a fish. Now, this kind of fish is called a puffer fish. And puffer fish are known for their spikes. So we're just going to make our puffer fish nice and spiky. Now you can go in and do it like this. You can drag. So now that I have my first color, I'm going to go in with a different color. I'm just going to start adding wherever I want. So now that you have your design the way you like, you're gonna push that off to the side and let that dry. Then you're gonna get out another piece of paper. Then you're gonna get out your black marker. And we're going to draw some fins. So we're gonna come over here and we're gonna do just some little fins like this. You could do lines in your fins. And then we're gonna do some eyes. I like to make my eyes one big, one small. So here's my small one. Like that. I'm gonna do a big one. Then I'm going to do a mouth. You could do a happy face, you could do a sad face. Whatever mouth that you're going to make, just keep in mind that you are going to cut it out. So I'm going to do mine like this. Just like that. So you want it to be smaller than the painting that you just did. So keep that in mind when you're drawing these. So now that we are done with this, we're going to go ahead and cut these out. Octopuses with no backbones. Hello, white sharks with razor sharp teeth. Hello, seahorses that make a heart. Here we go!
So now that your paint has finally dried, you're gonna take out your liquid glue. And you are gonna go ahead and start gluing on all your body parts. And now our fish is complete. So you guys can always go back in and add more decorations if you want. You can add water, you can add more little fish, totally up to you. But this is our fish for today and I hope you guys had a lot of fun. I'll see you guys next time.